Hello everyone and welcome to Assassin's Creed 2. Uh, my name is Jure and I'm gonna take you on this journey through this entire game. If you haven't seen the first playthrough of Assassin's Creed that I did, I highly recommend you watch that. Or at least like the story videos. Uh, that will give you a better understanding of what's going on in this game. And also um, for this game I'm going through for a full synchronization playthrough. That means I'm gonna get all collectibles, do all side content. Uh, stuff like that. I also recommend you watch Assassin's Creed Lineage. That's a short movie about 30 minutes that covers some of the events that take place before Assassin's Creed 2. And I'm myself reading through the novelization of this game uh, just before I play those chapters. So I'm a bit more familiar with the story and I can tell you a bit more about that when we go through the game. Uh, anyway, let's, uh, let's get into it. My name is Desmond Miles. I'm a prisoner of war. A war I never knew existed. Waged by two groups I never thought were real. Templars and assassins. The Animus showed me the truth. The things I've seen, the things I've been. A thousand years of history flowing through my veins, brought to life by this machine. They're using it. Using me to search for something. Call it the Apple. It's an artifact, one of many so-called pieces of Eden. The Templars collect them. It's how they stay in power. And if the Templars get their hands on another one, everything will change. They want to make us all their slaves. When they first brought me here, I was afraid of what would happen if I tried to fight back. Now? Now I'm afraid of what will happen if I don't. But I can't do it alone. And maybe I don't have to. I met someone. Her name is Lucy. I think she's on my side. But she's gone now. She was taken away by that bastard Warren Vidic and his Templar masters. I don't know what will happen to her, or what'll happen to me. All I know is I need to get out of here. And I need to do it soon. My name is Desmond Miles, and this is my story. And here we are. This is where we left off exactly. We have to go. Lucy, where have you been? Why did they- Now. And now we have subtitles too, so that helps a lot. Get in. What's with the blood? Are you okay? Look, we have maybe 10 minutes, maybe, before they figure out what I've done. If we're not out of here and on the road before then- Wait, we're leaving? Desmond, I promise I'll answer all of your questions, later. But right now, I need you to just shut up and do what I say. So please, get in the Animus. All right. Let's get in here. Bit different than before. That's us. Oh, my love. Me dispatch. I, I was at the bank when they told me. Did I miss it? Am I too late? Give him here. Giovanni. Shh, my love. It will be all right. Tu sei un auditore. Sei un combattente. Perciò, combatti. With the same buttons as before. Listen to him. A fine set of lungs. And what shall we call him, my love? Ezio. Ezio Auditore da Firenze.
Get up. Let's go. Yeah, well, I'm gonna need a second. There isn't time, Desmond. We have to leave. Let's go. Uh, really getting out of here, huh? Sturgo's got some fucked up interior decorators. Stay close. Hey! You're not supposed to be up here! Open this door! I'm calling it in! We have a breach in the research wing. I repeat, there's been a breach in the research wing. Nice walls. Fancy. Why they... There they are! Don't let them get away! <laughs> Damn. Oh. Holy shit! She can fight. Cameras. I rigged them to loop old footage. How do you think I managed to hide all your nighttime snooping from Abstergo? You're good. So I've been told. But they're on to us now. We need to hurry. Careful. We need to get to that elevator on the other side of the room. Follow my lead, but keep an eye out for security. I'd rather avoid a fight. All right. Is that an animus? Wait. Stay with me. Yeah. What the? How many of them are there? Along. Stay close. Is it animuses or animi? What do you think, Lucy? Lucy, what do they need with all of them? Desmond. Fuck. I thought this card would work. It must be on a separate system, and I don't have the code. Wait. How did you do that? I don't know. I don't know. Let's go. It's always something. What was that in the animus? Subject 16? Itzio, Audi, Audi something? I think we've been wrong all along. That's why we need to get out of here. Vidic and the Templars, they're only part of the problem. What do you mean? Uh -oh. I'll explain when we get there. Get where? Uh oh. Alright, come on, man. Yeah. So, the combat system is roughly the same as before. Only a bit improved here and there. It's a lot smoother now. Damn, Lucy. Get in. You're joking. It's for your own protection. Oh, man. We're almost there. Bam. Gonna keep that again. Oh, get me out. Thanks for that. It was great. Shoving shove in the trunk, bouncing around. Love this it. way. So, gonna tell me what's going on now? There was a reason for the escape, Desmond. Figures. We need your help. For what? Another treasure hunt through time? Abstergo's gonna replace their Apple of Eden. The map your ancestor found guarantees it. The other assassins, they'll do what they can, where they can, but... What? What is it? We're losing this war, Desmond. The Templars are too powerful. And every day, more of us die. 
I still don't see how I fit into things. We're going to train you. Turn you into one of us. What? No. No, you've seen me in action. I'm no good at this, and even if I was, it would take months. Years, even. No. Not with the Animus. Not with the bleeding effect. But I'm just one guy. Sometimes, that's all you need. So that's why you found him. My ancestor. What was his name? Ezio? If you can follow in his footsteps, you'll learn everything he did, just like he did. Years of training, absorbed in a matter of days. You broke me out of Abstergo and brought me here just to make me an assassin? Look, there's more to it than that, but it'll have to wait. Trust me, okay? All right, I'm in. Tell me what you need. Really? You're sure? I thought you'd be happy about this. Sorry, I'm just a little surprised. I spent the whole ride over here figuring out how I was gonna convince you to do this. Save it. After what those Templar bastards put me through, I'm ready, willing, and able. Thank you. Yeah, so we need Ezio to, to well train us through history. So we can become an assassin here too. Lucy! You made it! God, it's been so long. Seven years, can you believe it? Indeed. Welcome back. Ah, so this must be the infamous Subject 17. Desmond Miles, was it? Who are you? I'm sorry, where are my manners? I'm Sean Hastings. This is Rebecca Crane. Nice to meet you, Desmond. Right, well, it's been lovely chatting, but if you don't mind, Desmond, it's best we get straight to work. Time is precious. Doubly so these days. We've got everything set up and ready, Lucy. Just say the word and we'll get going. Here, I brought you something. A parting gift from Abstergo. Whoa! The memory core! This is amazing! With their data, things are gonna go a lot faster. I'll get to work on merging the code. Ooh. Alright, let's uh, talk with everyone. Let's start with Lucy here. Hey, listen. I just wanted to say thank you. And that uh, I'm sorry. Sorry? Yeah, you know, before. Everything at Abstergo. It was just... I wasn't ready. It's okay. No. Going through all that. Knowing that the Templars still exist. What they're planning. What's done is done, Desmond. You're here now, and that's what matters. Lucy, I've been seeing things. Symbols in my bedroom. The code on the keypad. Just like Altair. It's from the bleeding effect. You're taking on more than your ancestors' memories. You're taking on their skills, too. In this case, Eagle Vision. Skills? You're more receptive now. So if all goes well, everything Ezio learns in the Animus, you'll learn too. You really think this will work? That I'll become an assassin? You already are an assassin. You'll just be better at it. Yeah, hopefully much better at it. I mean, seriously, I saw the tapes from Abstergo. You didn't even try and escape. What a dick. Sorry, Desmond. I've got some stuff to take care of. We can talk more later. All right, let's talk to Rebecca. Hey, Desmond. What's up? Just wondering what your role is in all this. I take care of Baby. It's my job to keep her up and running. Baby? You mean the Animus? Actually, I prefer Animus 2.0, since Baby's twice as awesome as anything you'll find at Abstergo. The Templars might have deeper pockets than us, but they've got no ambition, no passion, no competitive edge. That's why, even with all their resources, anything they can do, I can do better. Faster, too. Anyway, take a seat when you're ready, and we can get started. I just need to make a few more adjustments. All right, let's uh, talk to Sean over here. What's all this stuff for? This stuff, Desmond. Oh, this stuff is nothing special, really, this stuff. It's just the stuff that keeps our entire operation from falling apart, really. It requires a great deal of concentration to keep it all moving, so you'll forgive me if I don't have time to play meet and greet. Sean's in charge of maintaining our knowledge archives. It's like a digital library. He'll be riding shotgun with me while you're in the Animus. So if you come across anything of note, people, places, events, etc., he'll create database entries you can consult for additional information. Yeah, it's not just databases, though. I also provide tactical support for the other assassins. You know, Desmond, the ones who are out there, actually doing stuff, risking their lives, little things like that. He's kind of a dick. Hello, Desmond. Go away. <laughs> Alright, let's get an animus then. 
So how does this work? Of course. Deep breath. Ah! Oh, what are you, a tiny child? Sean! Well... Here we go. Ooh, here we go. Uh, it's pretty cool how it builds up. I always love that about this game. Fourteen seventy six Florence, yeah. There he is. Insieme per la vittoria! Insieme! Insieme! Insieme. Silenzio, my friends! Silenzio! Grazie! Do you know what brings us here tonight? Honor. Viere de Pazzi slanders my family's name and forces his own miseries upon us. If we... Enough of your nonsense, Grullo! Buonasera, Viena. We were just talking about you. I'm surprised to see you here. I thought the Patsy hired others to do their dirty work. It's your family that cries for guards when there's trouble, Cotardo. Afraid to handle things yourself? Your sister seemed quite satisfied with the handling I gave her earlier. Uccidetelo! <laughs> <laughs> Uh oh. Oh, he'll pay for that. Fight Fiere de Pazzi's man. Here we go. So, bam, bam. Count skills look a lot cooler now in this game. Bam. And it's also pretty easy. I was gonna lie. There we go. Hey! Behind you! Federico! What are you doing here? I wanted to see if baby brother had finally learned how to fight. Oh. Uh, and? <laughs> you have style. But endurance is what counts. Let's see how many of them you can ruin before they get the best of you. Oh, here we go. Oh. Bam. Release me. Oh. Release me. You can even grab hold of them and bam, just knock them out. Come on, dude. Just just lay down. There we go. Ooh. More down. Hey. Fall back. Fall back. There you go. Hold on. What? We almost won this. Your lip. Just a scratch. Let the doctor decide. It's not necessary. Besides, I've no money for this doctor of yours. <laughs> wasted it on women and wine, huh? I'd hardly call it wasted. Lend me some floorings then. Or have you done the same? <laughs> <laughs> Search them. <laughs> There's bound to be something in their pockets. Yeah, okay, let's loot them. So this isn't stealing because it's the it's the spoils of war, right? Yeah. That's what the novel said. Money, give me those florins. Oh, I love this game so much. <laughs> Come on, then. Va bene, that should be enough. Let's get out of here before the guards arrive. There we go. First mission, but I really want to get all this money. Mm. 
Last one. There we go. Hurry, Ezio. The sooner we're done with the doctor, the sooner we can sleep. Follow Federico to the doctor. All right, easy enough. Oh, don't fall down. <laughs> Did you just say lovely tight pants? All right, I'm just gonna roll with it. Ben trovato, doctor. Hmm, fratelli auditori, why am I not surprised? You've made quite a mess of yourself, young man. It's nothing, really. You must help him. That pretty face is his only asset. <laughs> Forty <-t> <laughs> There we are. Now get out of here. Grazie. This way. Quite the night. Indeed. I only wish they were all as much fun. Oh, wait. They are. <laughs> <laughs> We should head home, Ezio. Father sure to be wondering where we've gone. Yes. I'd rather avoid a lecture. Up for a little race, then? To where? Uh, roof of that church. All right. Win the race against Federico. There we go. On the count of three. Uno, due, tre. I didn't mean it. We're going for a more direct route. <laughs> I almost feel bad about this. Oh, no shame in failure, brother. There we go. Come on, then. This way. Where are you going? You'll see. It's just casually crying this tower, right? Yeah. It is a good life we lead, brother. <sighs> the best. May it never change. And may it never change us. There we go. All right, enough of that. We really should head home. Let's go. Wait. What? Ezio, let Christina sleep. There will be time enough for that later. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Pay a surprise visit to the beautiful Christina Vespich. First get this viewpoint though. Yes, they are back. In all those, um tedious as in the first game though so I'm down completely safe so it's Vieri I'd better hide keep looking he couldn't have gotten far let's just go on the roof, roof again there they can't find us probably and here we are Him down. Christina! Christina! Who's there? Me! Oh, it's you! I should have known! May I come in? Fine, but only for a minute. A minute is all I need. Indeed. <laughs> well, wait, uh, that came out wrong. Come here. Oh, oh it's you. Oh, it's you. Yeah, this game is better than the first one. Christina, 
Christina! Uh oh. Velia, your tutor will be here soon. Come, my daughter. Is it really so terrible that... Figlio d'un cane! What is this? Perdonate, messere! Mi chiedo venia! I'll kill you! No, no. That's not necessary. Guards! Guards! Voglio la sua testa! Now! Yeah, let's it's get really out of here. Violence. <laughs> Damn, I'm losing him. You have me confused with someone else. She needed some help with some things. <laughs> I'm mostly innocent. There we go. Doctor's now available for healing. Yeah, okay. So we now get her health back through potions and stuff. I think. Anyway, let's uh, climb this viewpoint over here. See a bit more of this beautiful city. Climbing is also way faster now. Now on the minimap in the lower right corner you may notice some icons here and there. That's because there are shops in this game. Which will let you buy paintings, armor and all that kind of stuff. So it's a really more in-depth than the first game. Anyway, let's uh, let's go home. Just around the corner here. Good morning, father. Come with me. Is something wrong? Do you think me blind and deaf, son? I know all about your fight with Vieri di Pazzi last night. And then this little visit to Christina. Your behavior is unacceptable. It... It... It reminds me of myself when I was your age. I assume these misadventures won't interfere with your work today. No, padre. Avete la mia parola. I've prepared some documents here for Lorenzo Di Medici to review. I need them delivered to him. With haste, father. Return to me when it's done. Delivered Giovanni's letter to Lorenzo, Lorenzo Di Medici. Let's climb up here. It's probably the quickest way is across the rooftops. Because uh, the path, see? Are down there and they want to kill me basically they don't very like me very much because vieri tried to hit on and uh, kind of rape christina earlier in the novel and we kind of saved her and that's how this uh, whole feud started between the families well they didn't like each other in the first place but yeah uh before we go down let's first get this viewpoint here Go. Right, let's go down the ladder here. The quality of our speeching is legendary. Here you know you are getting the best. Ah, Ezio, ben trovato. How are you? Come sempre. I have a letter for Messer Lorenzo. I'll see that he receives it when he returns. Returns? They've gone to Villa Careggi, I'm afraid, and not expected back for at least another day. I'll let my father know. Alright, and on our way back. Now, in the previous game, we had to unlock, yeah, ledge grab and all that stuff. But um, that isn't the case anymore. We already have that, so that's nice. This is our family palazzo. Which is, uh, we're pretty rich, we're a banking family. Yep. Oh, a chest here. These are scattered throughout the game. And I'm gonna collect all of them too, so that's fun. Uh, we can unlock unlock maps later on that show their location, so I'm not gonna worry about them now. Only when I see Keep them. Keep up the good work. Biscero. <laughs> you worry too much, Giovanni. Francesco Di Pazzi is in prison. The threat is ended. Ah, hello, son. 
You remember my friend Hubert? Good morning, Gonfalonieri Alberti. To you as well, young man. I trust you delivered the message. Si, padre. But it seems Lorenzo is out of town. Hmm. I did not anticipate this. What does it matter? So you wait another day or two. Listen, your mother and sister have been looking for you. I'll need you again in a little while, but for now, see if you can't help them. Are you sure? Yes, now if you'll excuse us. Good to see you, Ezio. I don't trust him. And now we can choose what we do first. So that's exciting. That's also new. But before we do anything uh, further, I'm gonna collect all these. Uh, well, collect. I'm gonna explore all these viewpoints to get a better view of the city. All right, there's the first tower. Let's climb it. Let's turn around the circle. Uh, the, I mean, not circle, it's a square tower. Look how fast the climbing is now. Way better. And oh, just one jump. Wow, isn't it great? And let's make our way to the second viewpoint. And uh, this white wall here is uh, not available yet. That's another sequence of DNA. So we'll explore that later, of course. But that does make it very easy to explore the city in sections. All right, here we are, second tower. Oh, look at that cathedral. I've been here in the real life. I got to play with the orchestra at that old tower thing in the background. There's like a, a statue gallery and we got to play there in front of a lot of people. And I was like, oh shit, I climbed that in this game. That was quite, yeah, it was fun. Anyway, here's the viewpoint. So there's 73 viewpoints in the game. Quite a lot, right? Yeah. We'll be climbing a lot in this game, but I'm gonna... Cut in such a way it's not boring to look at. Anyway, we need to now climb this giant cathedral. So I'm gonna see how I'm gonna do that. Let's first climb this building because this has a lot more ledges. Here we go. We'll climb up here. Ah, we can climb up here, I see. Now we can jump this window. Yeah. Look how fast this goes. Oh, feels so good. After playing that game for the first game for so long. Let's continue way up here. And inside we go. And there's a chest here. Wow. climb inside further okay are we gonna get up here like this there we go and we are at the top wow i think this is the highest viewpoint in the game already <laughs> but just look at this city this is firenze or florence florence i don't know uh, yeah, pretty cool, right? Yeah, that's completely fine. All right, only one more view, view point to get. Ooh, chest, chest. And that last viewpoint is the Palazzo Vecchio. The old palace, I guess. Let's make our way up there. And there are no guards around, which is... Uh, well, good for us. All right, one more tower here. Oh, there are guards around. Oops. Ah, uh, don't mind me. Don't mind me. Oh, just a tiny bit more. And here we are. Now there are a few side missions we can do already. So there's a race here and a messenger mission here. So let's just do that since we're here now and uh, we're going for full synchronization, right? So here we go. I can outrun anyone in this distretto. I hear you the best. 
Prove it. Oh yeah. Bet you can't beat my record. Let's see about that. Yeah, these are like kind of like the rooftop challenges from the first game, only not as well, tedious. Come on. Yeah, oh, that scares me, that sound. That's not good. Is this the final one? No. Don't get in here, Ezio. Right. Don't attack me. Oh. Is this the last one? There we go. Let's beat them up. Yeah, come on then. Come here. So these are Fis uh, Fis what's his name? Valeri's boys. The Patsy, yeah, the Patsy's boys, yeah, that's it. There we go. Let's loot them. We need that money. Alright, let's do this messenger mission next. Get this to its destination fast. Really fast. I'll pay you well. Deliver these two letters to guarded recipients. Let's make a way there then. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Now where the... Alright, next one. Uh, let's get the chest later. And down, down. Come on, down, down, down. Here she is. That's it. All right. Let's uh, help our family out with this uh, three little quest they got. Petruccio. What are you doing out here, Petruccio? You should be in bed. I want those feathers. What for? It's a secret. If I get them for you, will you go back inside? Yes, I promise. Obtain eagle feathers for Petruccio before he gets in trouble for sneaking out of bed. It's like in the middle of the afternoon, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, let's cut it up there. Right, that's one. There it is. And the third one is up there. And let's get back to him. Alright, where is he? Is he in here? Ah, oh, just, yeah, he's inside. Here, as promised. Grazie, brother. You still haven't told me why you want these. I will, in time. All right, I'm, uh, I'm excited to see what you will tell us. Hey, Claudia, how are you? Bene. You shouldn't keep things from me. <sighs> it's Duccio. What of him? I think he's been unfaithful. Who told you this? The other girls. I thought they were my friends. Harpies. You're better off without them. I loved him. No, Claudia. You only thought you did. He should suffer for what he's done. Wait oh, here. A... I'll go have a word with him. That turned out quickly. Find and punish Duccio. More like Duccio. <laughs> yeah. And we can also collect feathers now throughout the world for Petruccio. But I um, won't do that just quite yet. There he is. <gasps> Duccio! It's a beautiful. Nothing but the best for you, Amore mio. But what of Claudia? I thought you'd been promised to her. The father said I could do much better than an auditore. Uh oh. Ah! Virbante! Come, let us walk a bit. What? I had something <laughs> else in mind. Oh, Duccio. Mm. Mm. 
Ehi, hey, non rido porco! Ezio, my friend! Ah, ma che ti figlia! <laughs> you insult my sister, parading around with this puttana. W what are you talking about? I saw the gift you gave her, or the things you said. Maybe your sister shouldn't be so stingy with her virtù. You broke her heart. Ha! And now I'm going to break your face. I don't think about it. You auditores all talk me. But when it comes time for action, ha! You'll regret ever opening your mouth. I could have taught her she's lucky to have had someone like me. Bastardo! Come on then. Get up. Basta, basta. Headbutt. Kick to the gut and a punch in his face. So that again. And let's start with a punch to his face, kick to the gut, and headbutt. Bam, boom, beam. Come now, you bore me. Come then, get up. There we go. Yep. Okay, he's done with. from my sister. I think he will. Beat up episodes not available. I love how they call that. And we have one right here. Wow. That faithless husband of mine is cheating. I know it, as do all the neighbors. Please teach him a lesson for me. Okay. Beat up the cheating husband. Will do. Will me. Ooh, chest here. Chest, chest, chest. Let's get that. Right, where is he? That's him? Get down. Rachel, there. What folly is this? Yeah, come on then, fight back. Easy enough. Donato, if she wins, I give up. That bitch. <laughs> I mean, wonderful wife of mine. <laughs> ah, let's go home. Yeah. And there's a golden chest here, wow. Alright, one more quest over at our palazzo. Let's get there. Buongiorno, Ezio. Buongiorno a voi, madre. Come state? Sto bene. And you? Still recovering from last night? I have no idea what you're talking about. Of course not. Anyway, <laughs> I have an errand to run. I'd like you to join me. Con piacere. Come, it's not far from here. Help Maria with her errands. I know about your fight with Vieri. What fight? Per piacere. Let's not play this game. He spoke ill of us. I could not allow him to continue. I'm sure he's having a hard time dealing with the accusations against his father. Francesco di Pazzi is many things, and none of them good. But even I never suspected he'd be capable of murder. What will happen to him? I imagine there will be a trial. Will father speak at it? He'll have to. He's the one with the evidence. Still, I wish there was another way. You've nothing to fear. Everyone wants justice done. It is an unfortunate state of affairs, but it will pass. Here we are. Here we are. Yes, indeed. Hello, Leonardo. Madonna Maria. This is my son, Ezio. Molto onorato. L'onore è mio. Let me go and fetch the paintings. I'll be right back. Oh, I wonder which Leonardo is. He's a very in. talented. Imagino. Self-expression is vital to understanding and enjoying life. You should find an outlet. I have plenty of outlets. I meant besides vaginas. Mother. <laughs> back to your house then. See, si, see. Si. Ezio, help Leonardo, will you? So Ezio, what do you do? He's been working for his father. Ah, you're to be a banker. For now. And you, aren't, was it? 
Truth be told, it's been difficult for me to settle. Painting is nice, but I often feel like my work lacks, I don't know, a purpose. Does that make sense? I'd rather contribute more practically, more directly. Architecture, perhaps, uh, or anatomy. I'm not content merely to capture the world. I want to change it. Oh, Leonardo. I have no doubt you'll go on to do great things. Vi ringrazio, Madonna. That's kind of you. Yeah. Okay, let's go in here. Thank you for your help, son. Don't let me keep you from your other duties. It was nice to meet you, Ezio. I hope our paths cross again. Anchio. That's that. Right, let's continue with our mission here. Ezio, come in, son. I need these packages delivered to associates of mine in the city. I also need you to retrieve a message for me from a pigeon coop not too far from here. Va bene. I'll get it done. Come back here when you're finished. There are some things we need to discuss. And please, my son, stay out of trouble. Hmm? Deliver two letters and retrieve a third from the pigeon coop for Giovanni. Then return to him. Okay. Let's climb up here. Get to the first thing here. Here's the first point. You Giovanni's kid? No, idiota. He just happens to look exactly like the man. Give it here. Don't worry, boy. We're not contagious. At least I'm not. Uh, let's get to the second one. Here, over here. Yeah, 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 I'm coming down. <laughs> I have a delivery from... Giovanni Alatore? Yes. Were you followed? No. Why would I be followed? Give me the package. Tell your father that they're moving tonight. He should as well. Who's moving? What's going on here? Wait! Come back! Explain yourself! Uh oh Alright, let's get to the pigeon coop. Yep, 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 yep. Let's get up here. There it is. There we go, let's get back to our father then. Let's first visit this uh, art dealer here. Because here, we should be able to buy treasure maps. Yeah, select San Giovanni. Buy. Yeah, and now you see on the mini map, all the treasures in the area show up. So I'm just going to collect those. There's actually quite a couple of uh, treasure chests in the game. So I'm not sure if I'm going to show you me collecting every one of them. But let me know if you want to see that. I could just do like a little montage like I did with the flags. But it's not really relevant where they are or anything, so. And then right over here are the last two chests, I hope. There they are. Of this area, at least. There we go. Alright, let's uh, come back to our father then. Father? Federico! <gasps> Serezio! Thank God! What happened? Where is everyone? They took your father and brothers to the Palazzo della Signoria, to prison. And my mother, my sister. Ezio. Claudia. Are you all right? Yes, but mother... She's in shock. They... When she resisted... It's not safe here. Is there some place you can take them? Yes, yes, to my sisters. Good. Do that. In the meantime, I'll go see my father. Be careful, Messer Ezio. 
The guards were looking for you as well. Uh oh. Reach Giovanni's cell at the top of Palazzo della Signoria and find out why he has been imprisoned. Alright, let's get to the rooftop first. Avoid uh, the streets. Seems smart right now. We need to climb that building over there, so let's get there. So do you see that red area on the minimap? That's restricted access, so we aren't allowed up there. So it's going to be a bit tough getting around the guards here. Alright, he's not looking. Let's get up here first. Guard there. Oh, let's just climb the tower. Ezio, father, what's happened? Took a bit of a beating, but I'm all right. What of your mother and sister? Safe now. Aneta took them. Yes. Wait, you knew this would happen? Not the way it did, and not this soon. Doesn't matter now. What do you mean? Explain. There's no time. Listen closely. Return to the house. In my office is a hidden door. Use your talent to find it. Beyond lies a chest. Take everything you find inside. Much of it may seem strange to you, but all of it is important. Do you understand? Yes. Good. Among the contents is a letter, and with it some documents. I need you to take these documents to Mr. Roberto. He was with me in the office this morning. The Gonfalonieri, I remember. Now please, tell me what's happening. Are the Pazzi behind this? There was a note for you at the pigeon. It said, go, Ezio. Go now. Let's go down the building. Jump. And let's get back to our palazzo or house. Recover Giovanni's documents and deliver them to Alberto Alberti. Hmm. Father said there was a door here. Oh, oh, that, that's quite noticeable. Ooh. Nice. Oh, there we go. Roberto. Yeah, so it turns out a father is an assassin. Wow, uh, we'll learn more about this. Now, these documents probably, uh. Oh! Traditore! Oh. Hey, what's with the swords? Aren't you supposed to arrest me? No! What do you want then? For you to die! Well, it's not going to happen. So why don't we explore other options? <laughs> and they're dead. Yeah, so these uh, documents probably have evidence that our father isn't a criminal. And we need to bring them to our trusted friends, Uberto Alberti. Because he can fix things. We just killed two cards, so that's uh, our first kill. Asetio, ever. Quite tragic. Alright, he's down here. His house, let's drop Get down in. here. Oh, more cards. Hey, we remember that animation from the first game, yeah. Hey. 
That's your auditory? What are you doing here at this hour? It... I, I don't... Wait, child. Take a breath. Collect your thoughts. My father and brothers have been imprisoned. I was told to bring you this. Ah. I see now. It's a misunderstanding, Ezio. Oh, who's that? I'll clear everything up. How? The documents you've given me contain evidence of a conspiracy against your family and against the city. I'll present these papers at their hearing in the morning, and they'll be released. Thank you, Signore. Of course, my child. Do you need a place to stay? You're more than welcome here. No, grazie. I'll meet you at the piazza. Don't worry, Ezio. Everything is going to be fine. Mm. Now, in the novelization, Ezio actually goes to Christina now. And, uh, well, there's big stuff going on, right? But he needs to lay down, so he rests there a bit. He, um, he uh, hides the rest of this, uh, the satchel he got from the chest there. And he goes to where we're going now, to the trial. But we're a wanted man now, so you probably should, like... Keep to the rooftops a bit. Hide from the people. Next right, let's climb down here. There we go. And Attend the acquittal of Petruccio Giovanni of Federico. To the small, unimportant village he was in. Uh oh. Giovanni Auditore, you and your accomplices stand accused of the crime of treason. Have you any evidence to counter this charge? Yes, the documents that were delivered to you last night. I'm afraid I know nothing of these documents. He's lying! Need to get closer. In the absence of any compelling evidence to the contrary, I am bound to pronounce you guilty. You and your collaborators are hereby sentenced to death. You are a traitor, Roberto, and one of them. You may take our lives this day, but we will have yours in return. I swear we will! Father! There! Grab the boy! He's one of them! I'll kill you for what you've done! Guards! Arrest him! Yeah, we couldn't trust him. Oh, it's a big boy. Abba Tetel. Run, boy. Fast. Let's get out of here. Go to the rooftops. And that's sequence one complete. Pretty heavy stuff. I've got a little request for you. I've identified several strange markings that I've discovered right across Renaissance Italy. Now, I don't know what they're doing there, but I want you to help me find out. Rebecca has marked their general location in the database with an eye icon, and she's made them glow as well. Keep an eye out. Okay, interesting. Sir Ezio, thank God. I've been looking everywhere for you. I, I couldn't stop them, Annetta. I tried, I swear. But there were so many guards. Please, come with me. We need to get you off the streets. What of my mother and sister? They're safe. I'll bring you to them. No, it's too dangerous for us to travel together. Tell me where to go and I'll meet you there. My sister's house, just north of the Duomo. I'm on my way. Alright, 
so some pretty heavy stuff this whole episode right uh, yeah our family got killed that's not good but yeah i'm gonna leave that episode here i'm gonna do uh, a sequence each episode there so they're gonna be pretty long these episodes but that's what people want so that's what i'm gonna do and then we have a nice sectioned uh, amount of episodes anyway thanks a lot for watching i hope you're just as hyped for me um hyped as me for this series and i can't wait to continue